Hello, Aquarius. Hello, hello, hello. We're going to do your love reading. This is for Aquarius Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Hello to anyone who's new. Welcome to Deep Soul Tarot. My name is Kelly. And anyone who's returning, welcome back. My tribe, what is up, my tribe? We're going to get right into this Aquarius because I got cut off. The Gemini reading got cut off. And I think Libra did too. So uh, if we get cut off, there will be a possible part two to this. Just keep that in mind. I'm really sorry if we do. I apologize ahead. Okay. This is going to be a general read, so it may not resonate for all of you. If it doesn't, um, do check the other placements in your chart. Sometimes those will resonate more. Even if this does resonate, sometimes the other placements resonate, can give you more information, particularly Venus in love situations. Okay, Aquarius, here we go. I'm not going to poo-poo around here. Let's just get her done. All right, Aquarius, Nine of Pentacles. Somebody else got that. Um, really? Well, first of all, you're single. Many of you are single and ready to mingle. Oops, sorry. Um, so, single, but you may be looking for love. Let's see. Two of Wands. That's weird. I swear. A couple of readings got the same thing. Um, you may have met somebody and trying to decide what you want to do, which way you want to go with this person. You're not sure if you want to remain single and just see them maybe as a friend or just keep it light or if you want to actually get involved with this person. You're a person, a magician, manifesting things. They have been thinking about love. So, you know, this could be a good connection. Let's see. Queen of Pentacles. Well, it could be an Earth sign. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. doesn't have to be, though. Um, let's get some clar little clarification here, just to give an idea of each of these. Um, with the Queen of Pentacles, I'm thinking that you both are, you both are staying grounded. And your connection, you both know exactly what you want, which may be each other. That would be nice, right? <laughs> That's always nice. All right, let's see what we have here. Let's just see if we get some clarification. First for you, Aquarius, all right? Two of Wands. What can you tell a spirit about Aquarius in the path? What choices or what is the energy of the Two of Wands? Here. Well, this one wanted to come out. Nine of Wands. So you actually, and I'm not sure what happened in your past. You may have had some bad experiences. Maybe recently you did. You were about to give up. I'll love altogether. You're like, you know what? I'm just never going to find anybody that is going to get me, that is going to, you know, understand me. And um, so the seven of wands, the two to the nine is the seven. The seven of wands, um, let me keep shuffling here. Um, I'm just sort of hearing that this person has given you more hope in love. So that's why you're thinking, should I get involved with this person? Because I don't think I've, I haven't felt this way in a long time about anyone recently. And they have sparked an interest. So let's see, them. they have been manifesting love. They're looking for love. They are looking for love. And you could very well be the one, you know? You could be the one. Queen of Pentacles. Let's see what we have for your connection. Queen of Pentacles, please, Spirit. What is the energy of the Queen of Pentacles? If we do get cut off, I do apologize. I really, really do. I am in the process of getting a laptop. The one I want is out of stock, okay? And I know I'm yammering on, but I'm explaining because this is going to end. So, um, Seven of Cups. So, trying to make a decision. You're trying to make a decision, I think, here. Uh, or maybe both of you are. The Hermit. It could be a Virgo. Like I said, it, was, it could be an Earth sign. So, it could be a, very well be a Virgo. Um, you may need to take a little time to go inside. And think about things, and the answer is within, Aquarius. Okay, it's getting close. <laughs> um, the answer is within you. So take a little time to think about this. Uh, there's no need to rush. Uh, I don't think this person's going anywhere. I think they have a liking to you, and you have a liking with them. So this could be a good connection. This could be. All right, Aquarius, I am so sorry that this is like speed. This is like speed reading here. Um, <laughs> Uh, thank you for tuning in. I appreciate it. I hope you will join me again in spite of my freaking technicality issues. Um, and hopefully I'll fix that soon. Okay, join me again. Hit the bell icon button. Join the tribe if you haven't already. And then in a week, we'll, we'll revisit and see what's going on with you. Okay? Thanks for tuning in. Peace out.